Hello, my beautiful Virgos, and welcome to your weekly love tarot reading for the week of March the 4th up until March the 11th. All right, let's go ahead and jump right into your reading. Hello, hello, my beautiful Virgos. How have you guys been? Okay, I'm going to go and start calibrating to the energies of my wonderful Virgos. Thank you so much, my guides, my angels, for providing any messages and guidance that my Virgos are here seeking to find this week. What do we have for Virgos this week? Always remember that energies are fluid, so take it as it resonates. If I'm not talking about you, it's a possibility that I'm picking up on the energies of the person that you are dealing with or the situation at hand. So always, always take it as it resonates. And remember, this can be for your sun, your moon rising, or your Venus placement. So if those are dominant within your chart, please make sure to check those out as well. And since it is a general reading, remember that energies can indeed be reversed. All right, Virgos, you are starting this week with the dominant energy of the wow. So the two of wands in the reverse right now, Virgo, you just are thinking about what's going to work for you right now. You're not even focusing on, okay, what's going to happen tomorrow because you have a lot going on. Perhaps there's just too much going on for you right now, but there will be an opportunity this week, okay? that is going to ask more of you. So it's up to you whether you want to pay attention to it or not, but I feel here there's this energy that I'm picking up on where you're going to have to go for it, okay? Say yes to it because this is what's going to move you forward and along the right path for you. All right, let's go ahead and see what's going on in your environment. Some of you guys might be dealing with any of the water signs. I see any of the fire signs. I also see, let's see, any of the air signs. What else do we have here? We have the sign of Aries. What else? Any of the earth signs? Sagittarius is coming out in your reading. What else? Earth signs. All of the signs. But like I said, there's going to be a message in a bottle, okay? Something unexpected is going to happen this week in the form of somebody sending you some kind of message that you were not expecting. And this message is going to call for your attention. Now, right now, like I said, Virgo, you might have a lot on your plate. You might have a lot going on with work, with family, whatever the case may be. But this person or place or situation is going to come in to kind of help you out. OK, so it's up to you to say yes or no. But I do sense here that this person wants to help you or help you open up your heart or help you open up a brand new business or whatever the case may be. But this person or situation is here to kind of move you along, like I said, into some kind of union partnership for you to start a brand new life and co-create. Because look at this. This is meant to be. This is divinely guided. This is a connection, a person, a, an opportunity of a lifetime. You've been waiting for this to happen. And right now that you are at your busiest or it's sort of like that energy where you're so busy, caught up on doing this, doing that, when all you need is to say yes to this opportunity. So look out for that opportunity. I do see here that you might come across as a little bit guarded, okay? So someone here, one person here is coming across as a little bit guarded. Maybe you're kind of like overanalyzing the situation. So it's telling you don't overanalyze it. It's here for you. It's here to help you open up your journey, your life, okay? Like I said, whether it's a career, whatever the case may be, I do sense here that there is a lot of good intentions here. Good intentions. This person sees you as very, very sort of like, um, like you have potential. You have potential either for a connection, you have potential for for a relationship, whatever the case may be. But this person has a lot of respect for you because they see you as the emperor. They see that you are independent, that you are in charge of your own life, okay? So like I said, this, this, this is a manifestation. This is literally a manifestation. You have been waiting for this to happen and it's time for you to say yes. All right, let's go ahead and see what exactly is going on here. What is this two of wands for Virgo? What is this two of wands for Virgo? Yeah, so like I said, Virgo, you have have already cut off all toxicity so there's nothing for you to worry about you have already done the healing and the more healing that you continue doing and that you do the more sensitive that your body your intuition is becoming to recognizing bad energy so there's not too much overthinking that needs to be done about this opportunity okay don't put yourself in the in the energy of introspection or at least too much introspection because you have already done that like I said there's this energy where things are starting to change inside of you this week. You're going to start knowing and feeling the changes. Maybe you don't know that it's happening, but you kind of intuitively are going to start feeling it. Okay. So 
things are going to start changing inside of you and you are going to start attracting and you are going to start noticing Virgo, how things are also changing around you. People start changing around you. They start doing things without you having to ask for it. Okay. So again, all of this healing, all of the self healing is all for all for brand new beginnings, okay? So here we have the Ace of Wands. This is a brand new beginning, a spark of joy. If you have been lacking inspiration, this thing, this opportunity that's gonna come to you this week is going to lift your spirits. It's going to kind of like put you in that state of, of abundance, of, of prosperity, of feeling inspired to, to continue on with this project. Maybe if you've been stuck in a project and you don't know what to do, this week is the week where somebody here is going to come in and guide you in the right direction. Now, I do sense here that you might be a little bit hesitant because you might not get the clear communication that you expect from this person, but this person I do sense means more. Um, they mean more than what they are saying, okay? They, they don't really have very good communication skills, but I do sense that this, it, this message, whatever message you get this week is actually going to work out in your favor. All right, let's go ahead and see. I want to know what exactly this page of wands is. What is this page of wands for Virgo? What is this page of wands for Virgo? Wow, look at that. Okay, so options, options. Yeah, so you are weighing out the pros, the cons, pluses and the minuses. You're not really sure. So I do sense here, like I said, you're going to want to take a pause, but don't take too much of a pause because then you're going to miss out on this opportunity, this help that wants to come your way. Okay, so don't weigh out too many things, too many options. You know, there's sometimes opportunities just come once in a lifetime sure they might come again but this is one opportunity that I do sense is here for you because look what's at the bottom of the deck the knight of cups if this has to do with love this person has romantic feelings for you they have good intentions they have a good heart okay if this is career related it is meant to happen for a reason for you guys to start a brand new project together co-create okay so there's not too much thinking that you should do don't bury the resolution for fear of what can come out of this, okay? So don't bury the resolution. The resolution is going to be here for you this week. Okay, my beautiful Virgos, let's go ahead and see what my guides and angels have for you this week. What do we have for Virgo this week as divine guidance and angel messages? Healthy lifestyle. Some of you guys, you know, this is just kind of like a reminder for you guys to start maybe fitness routine, something in your health has to be taken care of. Maybe you've been kind of avoiding it and help is here for you so that you can start figuring out what exactly is going to make your life healthier, okay? So healthy lifestyle. Archangel Raphael, eat a healthful diet and get adequate sleep and exercise regularly for optimal health. Maybe this is the help that you needed, okay? This confirmation here. One more guidance and angel message for Virgo. What else do we have here for Virgo? What do you desire? Yeah, so your manifestation here is going to happen this week. Something that you have been desiring is going to come in. So you now have the opportunity, Virgo, to write the script according to your heart's true desires. Once you clearly decide upon your true desires and know that you are ready and deserving of them, they'll rush into your life as if by magic. So remember, a lot of times people start manifesting something that they want, they want something, they desire something, and then once, bam, it's here, right? Once it's right in front of you, you doubt it. So don't be that person that doubts this gift that is coming your way this week. All right, my beautiful Virgos, this is what I have for you this week. Thank you so much for watching. If you are interested in a personal reading, please to check the description box below as I now have openings and follow my new Instagram page at Gina G official as I will be posting more on there. I do hope that you enjoyed your reading. I do hope that it resonated. Let me know in the comments below if it did and let me know what's going on. I really love reading all of your stories. Believe me, I read every single one of your messages. Thank you so, so much for sharing that in your comments below. If you did enjoy this reading, please do give it a thumbs up. It really helps to support me and my channel. And if you have not yet subscribed, please do subscribe to my channel. It really helps for me to continue posting these readings for you guys on this platform. Um, without further ado, thank you so, so much for watching. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.